this clip from yesterday's vlog. Here is my hot chocolate in a little pot. You can see the reflection of my naked, but I'm not naked because I've got something over my bollocks. As well as waffle with, I didn't ask for strawberries, but I'll take it. And I'm going to bed. I'll see you in the morning. Oh, heat. Hot, hot, hot. Tis a new dawn, tis a new day. I see a boat with jet skis and shit like that, which I'm interested in doing today. But at the same time, oh, that was hot. That was really hot. Ow. Breakfast of choice this morning, one apple, one muffin, and a cup of cereal. I'm tired. I know exactly what will snap me out of this state. Un latte. Oh shit. Oh, well, I've ruined that. Oh no, it looks like a nuclear bomb. Got to raid the buffet before they take all the food away. I've got three minutes to stuff my face. I did the best I could. I found a pineapple. I'm just messing with you. Look at th that. Is a poor, it's a poor selection of food put together, but I know it's exactly what I wanted. It looks mighty hot out there today. That's why no one's out there, because it's too bloody hot. I do not know how this ended up panning out, but the vice president of like operations at the hotel wants to meet me. I'm just laying in bed and I got a ding a ding a ding ding on the phone. And lo and behold, they're like, Tom, it's Linda. And I'm like, hi, Linda. And Linda's like, Tom, uh, we watch your videos and we're in the office right now and it makes us want to get out and do cool stuff around the hotel and around the world and stuff. And I'm like, that is awesome, Linda. Um, so she's like, can I meet you? And I'm like, absolutely. So I'm going to go meet up with Linda um, and somebody else to just say hi and introduce myself. I guess they watch my YouTube videos of me staying in their hotel. So let's see how this goes. Here in the hallway, I have found the cleaning equipment. But I've also found... Something. I think it may be a diffuser of some sorts. Yeah, and this pool got busy today. Everyone must have just arrived because on the first day there was probably like mm, 20 people in the pool. Now there's usually like 100. You know what? The weather actually isn't too hot today. That's okay. I was like, how the hell did the water reach from there to here? I got wet. Ah, got a little bit of sun on me before I have to go and meet Linda. I'm, I'm really hoping her name's Linda. Uh, and Linda, if you're watching this and you're not called Linda, I'm sorry, I'll, I'll get your name right in two seconds, but I'm gonna go quickly meet them and then dive back in the sun and toast my tits off all day. I walked inside to come and meet, I think it's Linda, but I bumped into these two who were just right. like, what are you doing in the hotel? <laughs> were, you. were you looking for me? Yeah, yep, me. well, the spies found me straight away, so I'm gonna go now before I get assassinated. I knew it, it was Linda. I got it right. <laughs> it was like, I answered the phone like, hello, and she's like, hey, it's Linda. I was like, I'm pretty sure I did just hear Linda. But I just got invited to a tent I don't know if, if I'm right saying this, a tent to take part in like the fasting. So Linda told me not to eat any more food for the rest of the day. Don't drink anything apart from water. I, I know like if you're truly doing it, you're not supposed to drink water or anything. You're just going to like go from like 4 a.m. until like sunset sort of thing. Um, but then at 7, I'm getting invited to a tent to have like a grand feast. And uh, yeah, it's going to be amazing. I cannot wait. Thank you, Linda. Dear Mr. Tom Cassell, aka 7am, 7 centimeters. my name is Hamad. Uh, I'm a local of this great city of Dubai and I'm a big fan. I've been watching your videos every day. I've been watching since the Halo days and I could not miss the chance to meet you. Wow. Hamad, I didn't read your full letter on camera just because I thought it was a little bit personal and I didn't want to, you know, put that, publicize that to the world, but I'm glad you're in a good place and I'm glad I got to bump into you. Thank you very much for your phone number. And if I ever get some free time whilst I'm on this trip, I will hit you up and you can definitely show me around Dubai. But I do have a lot scheduled, especially now I'm going for dinner with Linda. I've got so much sunburn on the inner side of my legs that I have to kind of like position my legs this way to try and get a tan on this side. So the way I've invented doing it is by locking my toes in like that and sunbathing like this, like an idiot. But um, I'm just chilling in the sun because every time I get up, I go out in the water park or inside doing something. So I think I'm just gonna chill here in the sun for like the past three hours. For, for the next, the sun's got to my head. For the past, for the next three hours. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Damn, my glasses were filthy dirty, but you know what? This is why I sometimes wear Oakley shirts, because one, they're comfy as hell, but if you get the right kind of t-shirt from Oakley, it comes with, in the bottom of it, underneath it, a glasses cleaning rag. At look at it, attached to it like a little pocket. So now I can wear them in style. Hey, we're doing a re re review of Tom's tan. Let's go live to Tom's tan. Okay, so this is Tom's tan line from his leg to his socks. 
pretty terrible. Then we've got a nice tan going on here, pretty good. Then we've got a tan line here, pretty terrible. Then it's pretty damn pale, but it gets even worse. It then goes from tan burnt to white line and tan burnt to white line. So Tom is trying to see if he can get a third extra line of whatever. I'm going to look like a bloody refreshers lolly. Or what is it? Drums, drum, drumstick lolly times three. Who the hell wants popcorn on a beach? I don't get it. Either that's used for something else, or you can actually buy popcorn on the beach. Like, I understand a melon with either ice cream or sorbet or whatever it is, but popcorn on a beach? I don't know about that. Oh my goodness me, look at that. That is so sick. That is what the hotel looks like from above. And uh, I'm hoping maybe if I've got time tomorrow to get a boat tour from here all the way around, look at where this apparently is where like the she shakes live. I don't know if I'm saying that right. And then all the way around, and then all the way around the island and back in. Because apparently they have some money in houses on them branches. Oh yeah, I'm excited. I like your glasses by the way, good style. All right, oh my God, that's a lot of rocks. Oh yeah, one handed paddle boarding, Tom. This is the greatest decision you've ever decided in your life. I would try and put my phone like down below me and then do it with both hands, but I don't know. Oh, also, I'm going around in circles here. This is great. I am easily going to fall off this any moment here <laughs> into the river, lose my Oakleys and my, my phone. But whoa, I don't know how deep it is out here. One of the people saw me struggling that much and he seen me filming my entire holiday to the point where he was like, I got you, so I appreciate it. I'm going to stop in the middle of it, like a grand, oh no, side of it. Ah! <laughs> and that's how I try and take a photo if that even works, but nonetheless, shit, I nearly fell in. Bye bye now! Bye bye! Bye bye now! Oh, turn the camera. Okay, sweet. I would choose one of the most exhausting things to do whilst I'm trying to chill out, but you know what? I've not done it before, and it was fun. It was fun. I've got about 10 minutes left before I need to go back, but that, my friends, is what you call a solid view. Again, no idea if you can see it or not, but. Still, nonetheless, pretty damn awesome. Hmm, this is cool, but no one said I can't use this to pirate acquire that ship or that boat. So let's do it. Almost there. Almost there. Wait for it. Come on. I've only got one hand. I can't exactly paddle. I'll we'll keep her going. Look at this. Oh, whoop. Yeah, yeah. There's your paddle back. Thank you. Ah, time to get a boat. Ah, messing with me. I don't want to get kicked off the bloody resort. Maybe next time. Well, actually, I've only got one day left. If this video reaches 150,000 like ratings, I'm stealing this boat for an hour. Yes, that's a good deal. <laughs> okay, that looks pretty cool. If I would have known that existed, I probably would have got that. It's got a bloody... Well, that doesn't look exactly safe, but it's got a motor. Oh, man, the sun has gone down, and my sunburn is starting to show. Boop! Ah, great. I'm going to be so bloody red. I did put sun cream on, by the way. So I don't know why I've got a list. I just didn't put on enough. Why did nobody tell me I could get one of these? Oh, my God, that is amazing! A Star Wars flow. Oh, my Lord, that's incredible. Ah, yes. Listen. The great sound of squelching flippy floppies. Beautiful. Another three hours before my blog goes live. Heck yeah, look at that. Three hour time difference. Sheesh. I've not eaten anything since breakfast. Is anyone there? That'd be awkward. No. So the fact that I'm starving and like weak as hell that I've not eaten any food. Imagine um, actually doing the full Ramadan fasting for 40 days. Uh, not eating from 4 a.m. till 7 p.m. A oh, damn, Daniel. Nah, Boots, if this was you, you're a damn legend. Boots, if you guys don't know, has been one of my longest viewers of all time. And somewhere in a, I don't think, I don't know if he's from Dubai or just not far away. Um, but he was like, Tom, I've, I've got um, some chocolates being sent you. And I'm like, some chocolates? But I, I green lighted to the security saying, bring them up. And oh my God. Boots, you did not have to do this. A hamper basket full of chocolates. Oh my god, cupcakes, chocolate bars, cookies, biscuits. That looks like a gingerbread man. Hell yeah! Look at that! That is incredible! Flowershop.ae. Ooh, and what is this? Broadway Bakery. Oh, shit. Oh, booge, you didn't have to do this, man. Let's give it a read. Welcome to Dubai, Tom. Hope you're having a wonderful time in Dubai. Smiley face, Abdullah. Boots. Boots! 
You're the man. Thank you so much, man. I'm going to return the favor. I'm going to hook you up, up with something fatty style. So, dude, thank you so much, man. I am um, not sure how, one, I'm going to eat all this, and two, how, how I'm going to smuggle it home. Because you know what? I'm smuggling this home. The basket as well. I don't even know how I've managed this. I've somehow lost my wallet, but kept my room key, and my room key was in the wallet, but I don't know where the wallet is. I've checked the entire building where I was for my wallet, so I'm assuming that the walk between the elevators to my room, I've dropped it along the way. I don't know how I would have managed it, but I've lost it. Ah. I found it in the lift. How I found it, I don't know. Oh, I'm going out for food right now and look what I'm going in. Oh, ho, ho, ho. thank you very much. Okay, this is nice. I did not know we were rolling in style. Linda, I didn't know we were traveling in style. What's this? We're having a star in style, actually. Okay, okay. <laughs> so really we're going now to Asatir, the Asatir. Ramadan tent in Atlantis, Nepal. Okay. And you're gonna experience like how we break our fast in uh, during Ramadan in Dubai. Yeah. It's very um, like um, Ramadan atmosphere with all people waiting for the Adhan to uh, or for the prayer. Oh. Um, so yeah, you'll enjoy it. I'm well excited. I'm truly, truly excited. <laughs> Thank you so much for the invite. I really, really Our appreciate pleasure. that. We're happy to oh, have wow. you with us. Yeah, the sun's just setting. Oh, there you go. The sun is uh, just okay. setting. Top, Absolutely beautiful. Absolutely incredible. What a nice hotel. How long have you worked here for? Four years. Four years? <laughs> what? <laughs> yes. Okay. Do you live there? Do you live in it? No, oh. my office is there, unfortunately. Oh, right? that's but a shame. I, I really live like 10 minutes close from the hotel. Wow, that's and, amazing. Um, yeah. Very lucky. Oh my gosh, thank you very much for the ride. Look at this place where we're turning up right now. Okay, that's that's nice cars. Oh my goodness me, that is one hell of a nice G-Wagon. Nade shot, you should have got it like this, mate. Oh, I'm okay, thank you very much. Oh my goodness, um, I ended up wearing like my nice shoes and everything like that, but I feel very, very underdressed for this right now. This place is a pop-up tent that they've done for Ramadan and it is gorgeous. What? We just walked in as the prayer is starting and everyone's getting up to eat right now. This is crazy. Wow, that is absolutely phenomenal. Okay, this is amazingly laid out. I cannot believe we've managed to come here today. I just met the chef as well. He's very nice. Thanks, Ali. Wow, there is so much. Look at these plates. There's so much food. What is that? Oh my gosh. It's it's like um, Sm rice. Smells amazing. Rice and lamb. And rice lamb. and lamb. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna want a lot of that. That looks good. I think I've ever seen so many macaroons in one place. Oh my lord. I wonder if you can just pull them out. Look at this. <laughs> this is absolutely incredible. I don't even know what that. Chocolate fountain. I like. And then. What is this? Arabic baklava. Baklava? Yes. <laughs> Linda, I've got to say, I already feel like I'm full off the date. Like, the date has filled me up already. <laughs> Looking at this food is making me like... I'm, wow. I'm like worried if I'm going to eat anything, but I'm starving at the same time. <laughs> Look at this place. Oh, yeah. Just... Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's mad. I like how we come into the tent and the server right now. Absolute legend. Uh, also, <coughs> it's from England. So, pleasure, sir. Right, time to try some more traditional food. It's incredible, absolutely incredible. Already got all this food right now, and Jake's turned up with even more. What's this? This is the grill, mixed grill. Mixed grill, I'll take one of everything, mate. Give me everything, mate. Flipping heck. My lord, this looks so, so tasty. Try the chicken. This was a good decision. Mm. beef is incredible. Linda, thank you so much. You're I appreciate welcome. it. And obviously Jake. Thanks man. I appreciate that a lot. Pleasure. This was outstanding. And now I've got to find some room for dessert. So wish me luck. Also crazy. Bumped into a fan. Sat right there with his hat on. If you watch this in the vlog, very nice to meet you. Super nice. I was just sat here and he came over with his dad and his dad was like, he's going to be a doctor one day. I was like, you can do it. There's actually so much food we didn't try, but we went for a chef selection and it was outstanding. But I would like to say, I might try a little bit of this before I go. And I really want to try a little bit of that. I definitely think I have to take one off the wall though. I'm going to go for... 
this one. <laughs> That's outstanding. Look at how many people are in here. Absolutely bonkers. Look at how much food there is. Whoa, macarons. I have no idea what I've just ordered. Oh yes, it is the ice cream guy. I knew it. <laughs> nice. Okay, I, I don't know what that is, apart from I know that she's, and Linda's not too sure either, so. Give it a go. Cheese with orange bits. All right, I'm trying my first ever piece of it. I don't know, but it's incredible. We've asked Jake. It's pretty much just colored sugar, really. Colored sugar. Oh, there you go. It's not. Yeah, it's not carrot and it's not cheese. But it's sugar. It's colored sugar. The chef Ali came out. Thank you very much to show us how it's made. Is it just sugar? Yeah. It just makes it into it's really, really, really in the fine. Machine and uh, come in like a hair. Yeah, comes out like hair. Yeah. Wow, that's incredible. Oh, we cultured up in here, having some Arabic coffee, and it's, as Jake said, very bitter. And if you want more, I think you're supposed to pass it to them. And if you don't want more, you're supposed to go like this because the person stands there with a the, with a cup of pot of with a pot of coffee sorry i'm confused i keep thinking it's tea because there's no bloody milk and sugar in it the tea at a really whole height can you do that jake no. oh come on you're british it's tea i'll give it i'll give it a go give it a <laughs> oh no tea. i don't want you to lose your job mate <laughs> right there it goes oh, hang on hang on all right jake one down, three to two to go. Math. Nice. Oh, you fancy, man. You fancy. Nice, good job, lad. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, I just found. I was gonna. I was gonna cheers, Linda, but um, you don't cheers. Thank you very much. We're not allowed to cheers, but thank you once again. I really appreciate it. What an unforgettable experience. This was absolutely insane. I cannot believe I even came. I will definitely be back. I loved every second of it. The food was incredible. I didn't even know, but we were sat in the VIP slash, like, not royal, but like close to it, the VIP suite. So we were getting treated like royalty. It was amazing, but I'm now gonna try and head out to the Dubai Mall, which apparently is gigantic. <laughs> I forgot how hot it is outside. I'm wearing a jumper. I regret everything today. <laughs> Oh my lord, this place. That was amazing. That's a tent. I think it's permanently there, by the way. I don't think they take it down for any reason. They like they host weddings in there and stuff, but... I've never been to anything like that before, and I don't think I'll ever go to something like that again, just because I probably won't get the opportunity. If I could, I would. This place is absolutely... What's this district called? Hatur City. Wow, I think the W is where I'm going <laughs> staying in Los Angeles exactly. when I'm back out there on Sunday. So beautiful. Just cruising on the highway. Thanks, Linda, once again. I really appreciate it. You're the best. We're driving down the highway to get to the mall of... Dubai Mall. Dubai Mall. And it's pretty big, right? Big. Oh, boy. We've made it into downtown Dubai, and there it is. Oh, my gosh. It's so big, but it gets so thin, so like you really can't see it from far away, to be honest. I know it sounds stupid, but that is stupid tall. Stupid tall. It's almost. like decorated the palms. Yeah, gorgeous, absolutely yeah. gorgeous. Linda, thank you so much. You're, you're absolutely welcome. Insane. My pleasure. Like, Good to see I'm you glad you're not working tomorrow, so I'm not going to see you again. But you're coming into Dubai, and you'll come to Atlantis the Palms. Yes, sure. I will. I'm actually sad. You're great. Thank you so much. <laughs> and here we are. We've made it. And look at that. Oh my lord, this is a money line of cars. You've got the Rolls Royce over here with the doors. You've got a G Wagon Pimp Tower over there. And further behind it, there's a Lamborghini. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dubai Mall. <laughs> wow. You've got to be kidding me. You've just got to be kidding me. Are you taking the piss? This is inside a mall. What? <laughs> are you joking? This is even more shot. What the hell are you? 
You fat bugger. Oh, wow. Oh my god, it's got its mouth open. Oh, it's got big teeth. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. However, amazing. Not only do they have sharks in their mall, they have free Wi-Fi, which has 250 down, 170 up. They have faster internet out here, and they're in the middle of a desert. You kidding me? I thought it was a small tank. Oh, look how big it is! Look how big it is! Look how big this tank is! Just goes and goes and goes. <laughs> okay, Dubai, you win. Oh, that candy store smells absolutely incredible. Like, oh, I don't, I don't know why I sniff as if you guys could smell it, but it's incredible. It's candy making. Okay. Okay. Yo. You do not I mean, this is like yo sushi of candy. No way. This is incredible. I am very impressed. I, I, oh, is this guy? Is this, is this guy about to mess this thing up? Oh, oh look at that! A little sushi candy tray. That's so good. Look at that! <laughs> they have a damn cheesecake factory. I, I'm happy I stayed in the hotel, but I honestly need to stay here for like ten more days, just so I can come back to the mall and eat here and shop and do. They've got like even more. Even more sharks in that tank, so I like to swim with them sharks as well. I, I just need to come back or move here. Um, I've just decided to come to the toilet. First of all, this is a big ass toilet. Second of all, there's a goddamn hope with wood. Oh, is he sleep position? You get a, a, a mini butt shower. I love it. Oh, wait, I'm gonna wait for you to see it in the reflection. Ignore these people's feet, but look at it in the reflection. There it is. Breitling, let's go and see what they got. Oh my gosh, I've never seen so many gems on Breitling, especially this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, look at this watch. Oh, that is beautiful. This is a bad idea coming in here. Oh my gosh. The state of that bad boy. <laughs> but then look at this. Oh my goodness me. I don't know how much this is in GBP, but this is 87,000. 87,000 dirham. Wow, that is bling. Oh, I love it. Oh my lord. I walked in that store just looking for like a Black Avenger. It's like, Breitling's like my favorite watch. It's like my, my watch I've always loved and that's the only watch I can pretty much wear. But oh my lord. That watch with the diamonds on it is like my dream watch. They were throwing offers at me left, right, and center. Like, if you pay now, if you pay cash, we'll reserve it, all this sort of stuff. And I'm just like, I can't, I don't know, I can't, what are you doing to me? I can't do this. No way, it works out like a lot, a lot of money, let's just say that. They have taxis in the mall to take you where you need to go. I'm assuming they're free because that is incredible. This place is truly incredible. I bumped into a bunch of fans whilst I've been here as well. Like, I expected to come to buy and not meet any viewers whatsoever, but I truly have an audience out here. And it's so cool that if I ever do come back, I will 100% do a meetup, like 100%. I haven't had the time whilst I'm here now, because I've like just been keeping busy and stuff, but I would love to host a meetup, whether it's at the mall or something like that, but Dubai, I will be back. These little sparkles and all that sort of stuff. I had no idea that's where the, uh, <clears throat> the building is. Bloody hell, that is big. Some idiot dropped a phone, an iPhone, from the top down. Like, I'm not calling him out to start a war or anything, I'm just saying that. That is stupid. Oh my goodness, it's happening! It's happening! I love the music! Okay guys, if you don't want to watch this, skip it, but I'm going to be pretty much filming the entire damn thing. So let's go! Oh wow. They have fountains, they have 
because I'm so impressed by water. Oh wow, it sounds like fireworks. It's beautiful. I hope this song isn't copyrighted, otherwise it's screwed. Oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah. That is amazing. So good. Very awesome. Very awesome. I don't know how long this lasts for. just never ends. Just keeps squirting. It's definitely the finale. That's it. I'm telling you. That's got to be it. Oh, it was. Amazing. I loved it. Next stop, at the top with Burj Khalifa, aka Wiz's little brother. Or taller brother. Whoa, this feels like money. You know it feels like money when she's watching you with a Da Vinci wrote on her forehead. I know it's not wrote on her forehead, but it looks like it. Wait, what? Are you serious? They did a Mona Lisa backpack? <laughs> oh, fashion. I was supposed to be going to a bar. Uh, yeah. In 2006, it got up to level 50. Then they got to level 100 in 2007. Then they in 2000, oh wait, in 2007, they went up an extra 50 floors. Jesus. Then, after that, they managed to go up to 160, world's tallest man-made structure in 2008, and then in 2009, completion of the spire. And then, building completed in 2009. From not to 160 real quick. It's even got high music. We're still going. Here we go. Oh, my, my ears. Pressure. We're almost there. Oh my god. I'm, I feel like I'm tripping balls right now. This, this is the highest public we can ever go, yeah. Yeah, but some oh. other floor, maybe tier 165, <gasps> is for offices. And Whoa. above is the mechanical rooms for antennas. So now this is hella fancy. Okay, I did not expect this to be so fancy. I thought it was just going to be like a, you know, Empire State building up and we're like, yeah, that's great, cool, whatever. Mate, okay. this place is like hella. I think that guy's about to go and engage. He said, okay, let's do it. I was waiting for it. Oh, I guess not. But look at this, the water fountain display we were just watching is going on down there. It's been, a, it's been half an hour since I was just filming that. And now I'm chilling at the top. Wow, this is my most amazing camera angle skill of looking at it, but that looks so cute. Oh, look at the little water. Like, it's like water for ants. When aliens look down on us, this is what it looks like. They must be like, why are all these ants staring at water going up in the air? Idiots. I had a tour guide, but I lost it, so I have no idea what I'm doing. There's this like sensor thing, and then when I put like my hand up like this, right, it moves, look, look, see that? That's my hand as like a motion detection above it. And I found like an Easter egg over here. Dubai Marina, and is there any other Easter eggs? No, can I go underneath the tower? I'm a, oh, I'm on the top. This is so weird. Look at it. Whoa! What? What would I find over there? Alpha Hid District. Look at that. What is the point of this? I don't know, but it's great. Oh, okay. So at the top of the tallest building in the world, you can buy a briefcase full of knives. Alrighty then. Oh my lord, that's the mall I was just inside from the top. Look, there's the entrance that we walked in. Oh my god. Oh, the fountains are going up. What time is it? The firings are about to start again in another 10 minutes. Oh, I'll tell you what, that is exactly where I was stood, right there on that balcony. In, that's a, that circle there is the Apple store. But wow. Well, that was absolutely incredible. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. He's like, I'm running out of the camera. Hey! Just got a feeling that these are backwards, and I think your system has crashed. And we built this building in respect of the human spirit, respecting the city we live in, respecting our people, and respecting quality as well in what we do. It's not about tall buildings. It's about pride. This building is a very emotional one for all of us in the Middle East. We need a 
successful story for this region. And I'm glad that we've participated in creating a positive story about growth, about success, about progress, and about hope. I come all the way to Dubai and I'm now doing shopping for my sister. Great. Damn, high jewelry collection. Look at that. What is that? Is it, I can't tell if it's a goddamn parrot, it's a dragon, or whatever the hell it is. But that is a lot of money. I'm gonna leave. Okay, fuck yourself. Almost confident that's the same Rolls Royce as when I walked in and I saw the owners. Damn, that's a nice one. We got a Tesla looking nice. There is. Oh, what? Wait, what is that? That's not a Defender, is it? Wait, no. I want that. I'm not even. I want a Defender like that. How the hell do I get this done? Where is this from? Oh my god, that's like my dream Defender. That's like stuff I see on Instagram and shit. That's amazing. I thought it was a G Wagon. Ah, uh, nothing. Normal car, normal car. Oh, this guy's got style. Look at that bad boy. That is how you get around a supercharged what? What is it? Oh, nice G Wagon there. Nice G Wagon. Oh, look at the luggage on the back. <laughs> Brilliant. That is well cute. That is a nice ass car, mate. I like it. I like it a lot. But you know what? That's nice, but that's my ride. And this mall just keeps getting bigger and better. Not only is there a huge ass screen with a bar slash restaurant in it, there is an ice ring. An ice ring in the middle of a desert in the middle of a mall. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, that is a lot of fucking taxis. I am meister than an oyster, but this was an amazing day. I had an absolute blast. Linda, you're a legend. Thank you very much for the invite. I'm going to get my ass up to bed and pass the hell out. So guys, I'm going to end this vlog here. Make sure you leave a like, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you tomorrow for the next daily vlog. Don't forget, share this with your friends. And click that subscribe button and the little bell notification so you never miss an upload. And until then... I will see you all. Oh, AC units tomorrow. Oh, wait, I forgot. Sorry, <laughs>